in a year that's seen a lot of highlights from Kentucky State University, we're going to kind of go into a did you know type of thing. Starting with track and field. Did you know that junior transfer Dante Johnson has qualified in the Nationals for 60 meter hurdles? Dante, you talk about this season, you look at what you've already accomplished. What has been the key so far this year for you and the entire team? Um, the key so far is mainly just staying healthy, you know, maintaining what we've been doing in, in the process, um, working, working with our techniques and our forms, just to improve on our skills. Well, Dante, thank you. Congratulations on qualifying for Nationals, and good luck. Thank you, too. That's Dante Johnson. Now we move on to, did you know about Layla Foster? Layla is competing in the triple jump and the long jump and is working to qualify for Nationals in both competitions. Layla, you look at this season, kind of what Dante and I were talking about, you guys keep improving. When you take what you've done so far this year, what is really the end game? What's the goal for you individually and the entire team? The goal for me is staying healthy, but as far as the entire team, probably uh, the technique and conditioning right and staying in shape. So when you look at what the stuff that Coach has been teaching you all year long, how has that benefited the team in your mind? That's a good question. It's benefited us in um, many ways. I mean, um, especially her being an Olympian, her knowing what we need to do and do it correctly as far as technique and all. I think that's probably been the most that benefited us the most. That is senior Layla Foster as she's competing in the triple jump and the long jump. Thank you, Layla. Now we move on to another senior. We go to Joy Hearn. Now, here's the thing about Joy. Every single competition you've had this year, you've improved your time in almost everything. How and why? Just being consistent, putting in extra time, even after practice, if I have to do it at like night sessions at um, the gym. They have a gym in Frankfort, Kentucky. I go to and put in more work and with my coach. So. so you keep improving, things keep happening. How is this going to translate from the indoor season to the outdoor season, just a few weeks away? Well, the indoor season, my coach has me in the mound or had me in the 800, so it helps me with my endurance. So then when outdoor season comes, it helps me with my speed and helps me with breathing whenever I do the 800. Congratulations, Joy. Thank you. Give the good work. Thank you. That is Kentucky State University track and field. A lot of did you knows as they have keep progressing throughout the season. For Thoroughbred Sports Network, I'm Eric Matthews.